first as well. Okay. Yes. They Thank really you. did ramp it up defensively, though. I'm telling you, it was like role reversal. Yeah, absolutely. They played like the Bears were supposed to play. Mm -hmm, it yes. was. Thank you, Jim. Thank mm -hmm. you, Jim. Blu-ray or HD, that's the new choice in home entertainment. Mm -hmm. They are the new competing formats uh, for home video. Each has advantages, but only one may survive. CBS 2's Josh Rubenstein has the pros and the cons. Sometimes it's tough to keep up with technology. In the 80s, there was the VHS tape. Sure, the quality was poor, tape always got chewed up, and you couldn't take it on an airplane. But then came the 90s and the DVD. Much better quality, and you could take it on an airplane. But this is 2007, and it's time for something new. But you're going to have to make a choice. Is it Blu-ray or HD? There's nothing like a good rivalry to generate excitement. Think of some of the classics. Max and PCs, UCLA and USC, cats and dogs. Going from standard definition television to high definition television has been the biggest leap in technology for consumer products. It far outreaches even going from black and white to color TV. But a new rivalry in home entertainment may change the way you watch movies. It's the battle over high definition discs, two very different formats. HD DVD. HD DVD is the format that's been developed by Toshiba. It gives you a backwards compatible system that will play standard definition DVDs and the new higher definition DVDs. And the Blu-ray disc. The system that's developed by Sony, it literally uses a blue laser in the player itself to give you more uh, high definition picture uh, from a disc than you can ever achieve from a standard definition DVD. They look similar, but these two pieces of plastic are as far apart as Rosie and the Donald. If you're fuzzy about high def, I'll try to sharpen the picture. It's like a higher thread count. So, you know, the Egyptian cotton, it's like 900 thread count. It's obviously more tightly woven, so there's more lines that are going across, so there's less gaps to be filled in by white space. You look at the pictures, they're so much brighter, clearer, uh, more detail than ever was available before. And now we have HD DVD and Blu-ray that can fully utilize all that capability of the high definition television. The Blu-ray disc is capable of holding more data, up to 50 gigs, but its size makes it fragile and pricey. The HD DVD is made by Toshiba. The disc can't hold as much information as the Blu-ray, but it's cheaper to manufacture. With HD DVD, you can pull up menus uh, and look at commentary from the director, uh, actor uh, comments while you're watching the movie. You don't have to leave the movie to go look at the special features. Blu-ray has a slight edge when it comes to picture quality and networking capabilities. We have one Blu-ray player from Pioneer Elite that will actually allow you to network your computer system into the Blu-ray player. You can pull music files, pictures, and uh, videos from your computer through the Blu-ray player and display them on your television. Both formats will be able to play the old standard DVDs and in most cases at a higher quality. So when all is said and done, which one's better? Well, if you just want to watch a movie, you don't need a whole lot of extra features, Blu-ray may be the way to go. Costs a little more, but the quality is impeccable. Now, if you want something a little snazzier, you want picture in a picture, menus on the side, extra information, HD DVD may be the right choice. It's also a little cheaper, but there's also one more option. LG just came out with a player that plays both Blu-ray and HD DVD. While many of the big movie studios will be producing their movie discs on both formats, Columbia TriStar, which is a division of Sony, and 20th Century Fox will only be producing on Blu-ray. Adult film producers, however, have already indicated they'll be producing on HD. If you remember the VHS beta battle of the 80s, the VHS won because of the porn industry. Gaming platforms are also in on the fight. A lot of people now got the PS3 from Sony, so that actually is a gaming software that has the Blu-ray technology in it. The nice thing about Xbox 360 is that there is something that is a hardware that you can attach to it that will make it HD DVD. There are plenty of interested investors on both sides. It's hard to tell which disc will be left spinning when this format fight is over. In West Hollywood, Josh Rubenstein, CBS2 News. A good night for Colts fans to celebrate, but not if they're driving. Police, sheriff's deputies, and the Highway Patrol are looking for anyone who's staying at the party a little bit too long. CBS2, Stacey Buck.